What's going on guys? Texas Fan and Rehab here. Hey, with some exciting news. Texas just broke it that Case Keenum, not Davis Mills, is going to be starting this week. And let's get into the reason of the case for why Case Keenum is the better quarterback. Um, of course, I've already stated that um, I don't rock with Davis Mills. <laughs> I think the fact that C.J. Stroud has already, you know, beat him to the punch and, and taken over the job in, in, you know, legendary fashion is all the examples that we need for why Davis Mills is not uh, the starting quarterback. But in, in, in lieu of the fact that C.J. is not available, let's cover the, the grounds for why Case is actually the better uh, quarterback for this particular week against the Tennessee Titans. So number one, what are we trying to accomplish here? You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, this is a race to try to get into the playoffs, right? So, you know, what are we ultimately trying to accomplish? Are we trying to get into the playoffs? Are we trying to look at the playoffs and, you know, tinker around with it and just possibly get a win or two here or there or whatever? I think we got to look at what's, what's really going on. I mean, I think it's interesting to figure out how uh, Case beat out, <laughs> beat out Davis Mills in the first place. I mean, you know, maybe it was this race or something. I don't know. Warm up and practice, something like that. <laughs> but nevertheless, I mean, you got to think about what's the end goal here. What are we trying to accomplish? And I think that, you know, Case has definitely, uh, you know, put his his mark on the on the game over the years that he's been playing. He's definitely uh, showed that he's a, a, a great uh, in game manager. Um, he's, you know, if you will, the original Brock Purdy, right? <laughs> this is a guy that's done. Uh, a number of different things with a number of different teams and he's shown that you know he can be consistent and he can be uh you know thorough with the game plan and and, and you know basically perform under pressure and get the most out of the talent that's around him man so um definitely you want to go with a guy that's like that he's the great uh in case of emergency break glass quarterback and that, that's what you need on your team so this is one of those times. I think the only reason why we haven't gone with him more is probably more so because of his age and just for these type of situations where you want to have him just in case at the end of the year, you want to have him healthy and ready to go as opposed to, you know, having him exposed to some sort of random injury earlier in the year. And then you throw Davis Mills out there and you're, you're officially done. You know what I'm saying? So that's one. Um, uh, the second thing is he's just, he's accurate, man. I mean, you know, you guys can remember back to when he was playing with the Texans originally, right? I mean, you know, these clips don't, you know, like they just don't tell the, the full story of how accurate he was on, in clutch situations when we needed him the most. He was the guy to step in and do what he needed to do. Um, you know, we we have lauded over guys like, you know, uh, uh, TJ Yates in the past and, and guys that have done miraculous things in situations similar to this, but they had a playoff atmosphere about them. Case is well capable of doing that very same thing. So I think that Case and his accuracy and his ability to throw the ball and drive the ball down the field uh, is more akin to what the game plan calls for. It's more uh, uh, liking to what C.J. Stroud has already provided uh, Bobby in the offense. And, you know, this offense has been one to uh, be in the top of the league as far as driving the ball downfield in the first place. So you definitely want a guy that's going to be aggressive and accurate in that in that same sense. And so the last thing that I'm going to say about this, and this is the one that puts it over the top for me, Case has the playoff experience. Of course, you guys remember the Minnesota Miracle, right? Who was the quarterback when that happened? That was Case, right? So you got to remember that this is a guy that's seen it, done it, been there, all of that stuff. Sure, he's a little older in the tooth. Sure, he's, you know, got some years behind him. Sure, all of that stuff. But that's why we got him here, right? That's why he came back to us. That's why we signed him. That's why we had him on the on the roster in the first place. Because we wanted that grizzly old vet that knows what to do when the game matters most. And so that's why we have Case on the team. That's why he's clutching this moment. That's why he's the one getting started for this week. And uh, really, the better question that we have to ask is... Can you give me one more day? I'm not asking you for a week. I'm not asking you for a month. I'm not asking you for a year. Can you give me one more day? We'll deal with tomorrow when tomorrow gets here. Can you give me one more day? That's all I'm asking for. 